What's going on my dudes one step here and no what you are seeing right here on screen is not a Mortal Kombat 1 mod This is the official first in-game look of Homelander and they started this first look with the best freaking scene possible They actually Included the biggest meme we've ever wanted got milk Absolutely hilarious that this is his like uh, Victory post so if you haven't seen the trailer yet I don't know how you haven't already seen it. We're gonna watch it real quick It's like 45 seconds and then let's Let's talk about it. Dude, him starting off with the milk. Like, it's so awkward. It's so crazy. Pharaoh looks awesome, by the way. Oh, man. So right there, pa okay, now, so we'll go back in a minute. You have chosen war with a god. No, you have. I'm not disappointed. I'm not like pissed. We'll talk about that too. Oh, loving Pharaoh. Ooh, loving the lasers. Let's go. Oh, we got a first look at the fatality. Love to see it. All right, cool. And then I think this is part of the fatal blow or it's this fatality number two and that's it So we start off like I said start off super cringy super awkward with him going for mama's milk Oh my gosh, I knew they were gonna do some memes for homelander But man, they knocked it out of the park with this one dude Of course, they're gonna go off the show's references the show's memes and what the whole audience loves about the show And then they they did man. They're like we got to include the milk scene. I did not expect them to make it his victory pose, which we see right here with Farah. I thought they were gonna include the milk part, maybe for like a taunt, like a walk away taunt or something. And no, they're like, F it. This is his like entire victory pose. He's drinking the milk for victory, dude. I mean, aside from the pose itself, Homelander looks awesome. His in-game skin, the stance, the whole cosmetic of him. I, I love it, dude, I love it. And honestly, like I said, Farah looks so good too. We haven't seen her since MKEX, so this is a really neat surprise. She's only a cameo. Oh, yes, but even then she looks great and then we see a couple surprises here at this uh, character intro screen We see Homelander, Farah, and Movado as of this recording We're getting Movado tomorrow, so we don't even have Movado yet So to see him in game with Farah with Homelander is is really cool because that means the development in the game Is making some really good progress like we don't even have Movado But yet they're already ahead of the game and they have in-game gameplay Maybe in-game looks for Farah and Homelander on the character selection screen I'm not quite sure what's going on with Homelander's face right here. Like how is this his uh, Character introduction on the character select screen here, but maybe they'll fix that I don't know. This looks a bit wonky in my opinion and Vera is on the shorter side so her having to ride something she's riding a giant bag of heads I guess to make her seem taller you know on par with the other characters I guess it makes sense because if you didn't have her she'd be like this uh, little short girl and maybe hard to see on the character select screen so it's kind of a neat way to have her fit on the screen I guess and again she just looks awesome I love the outfit I love the aesthetic I, I love the way that Farrah is being interpreted as a cameo for Mortal Kombat and we have to hear this intro one more time because because people are I, I don't think it's star they haven't confirmed if it is or not but i don't think it's the actual homelander voice let's take one more here at this you shall have we chosen war with a god no you have i i no sounds like it's not but then you have sounds like it definitely could be i think best case scenario we get star that'd be awesome i think worst case scenario we have another terminator situation where we have a voice actor that sounds pretty damn close to the original voice of them which i think is going to be passable like i don't think it's going to be a massive deal if it sounds that good i think if that's the case i think people are going to whine about it go oh you didn't get star so i'm not going to play homelander no more but then they're just going to get over it and it's going to be totally fine with guest characters like this the intros are really the only time you hear the voice anyways and they're like one sentence so i don't see it being a massive deal this is not like in a you know a giant cinematic universe where we have tons and tons of hours or minutes of cutscenes with homelander where we need the voice to be on par all the time they're really quick you know one to two sentences maybe in the intros i don't see it being a big deal personally if we don't get star and then his intro right here with fair and the lasers oh look super quick but yeah that looks awesome too i love the whole like fight intro there fatality right here super clean super classy easy and to the point and then oh, oh go back go back and then after the fatality we have i think this is part of the fatal blow I think either that's the fatal blow start and they come back down or this is the second fatality like right there boom boom 
<laughs> actually, I don't know. With that right there, it probably is just a fatality. I, I That's probably just both his fatalities shown off right there. Maybe I'm like way wrong. That's definitely not the fatal blow part. And that was it. That was the whole first in-game teaser we got. This whole cringy, awkward mommy milk thing. We got the introduction where they stand here and then they have uh, what we think may be a star's voice. We'll have to wait and find out. And then the fight intro with the laser eyes and then the two fatalities. So that is uh, unfortunately all we got for Homelander as the first sneak peek in game look for him am i mad about it no way i think homelander is gonna be awesome again i don't i don't think that not having star is gonna be a make or break for me personally i think having homelander in a mortal kombat game is just it's if you've seen the boys you know that it's just wild and actually it fits pretty damn well i'm excited to see his gameplay to be honest i'm excited to see like what he can do with like his his abilities his lasers will he play more like superman i'm guessing yes as of now we're gonna have to wait and see but i'm excited regardless and as i'm seeing this first sneak peek in-game look at Farrah, I'm actually more excited for Farrah than I was before. I, I wasn't too stoked for her, but now I'm kind of really digging. I, I'm loving the aesthetic and I can't wait to see what she offers as a cameo. If you guys know me, I love having utility in my cameo. I think she's going to be on that line. I could be wrong, but I got a feeling she's going to be awesome. If you guys are excited for Homelander and want to keep up to date on all the new Mortal Kombat stuff, subscribe here for more content because we have new videos twice a week and we stream twice a week as well. Let me know down below what are your thoughts so far on Homelander as a guest character and Farrah as a cameo. And then go ahead and click into these videos next for more guides and new tutorials and more.